he's, he's putting his head through the hole. So he's gonna get smacked. Yes! Oh, you gotta love it. Greetings guys and girls and fellow gamers, my name is games for cakes and welcome back to Smarter Days to Die, where we play 7 Days to Die modded and we're back with CB Mod by CB the Great. So we are in the middle of upgrading our base, I'm gonna be focusing on that, I finally got some water into our base as well and we were, we're working on opening this gun safe. So, but mainly we're gonna be focusing on the defenses of our base, we're gonna have to get a lot of wood, we're gonna have to make spikes, we're going to have to get... Um, probably to make some normal wood spikes as well and upgrade them or we're gonna make some sp uh, steel sp not steel spikes uh, metal spikes we'll see how many we have and how many we need actually to go around the block one time but either way I hope you guys are gonna have a good time watching the episode if you do remember to kick that like button in the balls to support the channel and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see hit that subscribe button so let's get started so this water here is as close as I like to have it we actually can get nicely up here on that side and I have my extra bucket here so basically the idea is you fill up the glasses you take the bucket now if you haven't seen before how an infinite water source works here in seven days to die you just need a, a two by two basically you go to any corner you get the water you have some left so you take your bucket and pick it up there you go and then put it straight back in and it fills the, the two by two sometimes even the little bit of water that's in the corner left just refills automatically so you don't have to worry about it it really depends like so i think there's some algorithm obviously that runs and um sometimes it just triggers uh, to fill it and sometimes not but that's what you have to book it for now let's get a little bit of forged iron let's put these guys in here as well there we go and let's open that Gun safe. I've been hacking away every, uh, every time a little bit, but let's see. Nothing in it. That's such a kick in the balls. It took me a long time to get it actually down. <laughs> but the good thing is we can use it as a gun safe and we can put all our weapons and tools in there, which is pretty awesome. So, um, which is nice. <laughs> okay, so let's have a look what we're actually going to do. Um, let's repair this first. 96 now let's um we don't need to repair that just yet and is there anything else we need to make i don't think so i don't think so okay so let's go downstairs now when we go around the house this year i'm going to have to destroy it. hopefully that won't take too long it's um the problem i have in the moment is energy we need minor 69 to go up um sexy saurus already took the max we need to wait until our athletics is at level 20 before we can take the next level of sexy saurus and like again we are kind of a little bit ahead of our uh, level like so our skill levels like we already made iron tools but we kind of shouldn't be using them yet i suppose so maybe if we use a uh, normal stone axe that we make uh, we get better results i'm not sure uh, to destroy everything faster but we're gonna try that out now the main thing is is to clear this out then get some wood there we go our mining level is going up which is really really nice and i might i'm actually gonna get that stone axe from on top because the stone axe is something that um is better when we're clearing out uh, leaves now that because it uses up less energy so let's have a look here we can probably craft a better one. Let me see what the smithing is like. I mean, we can craft level 150 now. Level 150, excellent. So let's do that. Let's, um... Oh, we have actually some, so we should be okay. Let's let's make a stone axe. And eh, stone shovel, I don't know yet, but we'll see. So it's 100. I thought it was 150. Am I misreading these all the time? I'm current level... Current level is level 2. Crafting quality, 150. Oh, by 6. So, we are actually... Sorry, this is showing me level 3. Current level 2. That is very confusing. Uh, so, this is what we're currently at. And this is what we will be. Okay, I just misread that. Okay, fair enough. Now, let's take this guy here instead of the axe. And see if we can actually get rid of the stairs quicker. Because of our stamina. So our stamina is actually not going down as quick, which is good. So after the block is gone, we're only down to 69, which is 10 stamina. But if we use this one here after one block is gone... Yeah, look at this. We're already at 69. Like So it's definitely more efficient right now um, from an energy um, perspective to be going with uh, the stone axe. 
But the problem, I think, with the Stone Axe is it doesn't give us any Miner 69er or mining. It's construction tools. So that's kind of a bit of a downer. Is there any... Is there a Scrap Axe? Is there any other axe? There's an Iron Axe. There's a Stone Battle Axe, but that's different. Um, steel Fire Axe. No, so there is no Scrap Iron Axe. I think the Scrap Iron Axes are usually a nice little filler in between there. Okay, I'm just gonna get rid of all of that and then we're going to do some count to see actually how much we need in steel spikes and in metal spikes and with 1170 metal maybe we have enough so it's a 14 by 22 house um, which is kind of a bit of a pain so it's basically 44 um, and 28 52 62 I don't think we're gonna be able to do that but we just leveled up which is really really good so as soon as my athletics is going up um, we can get the next uh, level of sexosaurus which is really good for our stamina now another thing that would be good for our stamina would be coffee but i don't have any coffee beans yet otherwise i would start growing them so it's another thing we have to look out for now molotov cocktails we're still limited but um i don't think we have enough i also had to upgrade actually uh, some of the blocks here and i'm gonna have to do the same with that we actually have to upgrade these bottom ones to fully metal And that's because we do not want to have any zombies being able to crawl in the house. Now, this here is the next level is concrete as well. So this, I think, is full upgraded cobblestone or is it just brick? I have no idea. I don't really know. But um, um, concrete mix is the next level to get uh, going on that. So we're going to get rid of this as well. And this one has a roof. Ugh. Okay, so, well, we might not have to get rid of the roof. We just have to get rid of everything down here so the zombies can walk towards us. Crap, we have a screamer. Let's just hope she doesn't see us. And that she will go right past our house. She literally just got out of this ground. She spawned in. And she's going towards the house. So we're walking away from our house. <laughs> I don't think... Oh, is she going to be a problem, though? Oh, she could be. I mean, is she going to hit the house? I don't want her to destroy the house. You see, maybe we should just take a pot shot and see if we get lucky. Is she going in the house? No. Okay. Let's see if we get lucky. We hit her? Let's go a little bit higher. I think we could have hit her actually, but um, I think we're either too high or too low. Nah, I'm not gonna waste my arrows. Let her be there. She will be there when we come back. End of story. We're not really worrying too much about it. Um, in the meantime, one of the things that is really good for energy is these guys here. So we're gonna chew away on them, seeing that we're hungry anyway. go very nice and we can chew away on them while we're trying to get some wood from the trees now yeah two wood four wood six wood so i think in this case it's better to have the fire axe because we just get more wood from it Ooh, burning doggy we want to stay the hell away from that or oh, it's burning wolf actually um not interested in that thank you very much okay repair and we probably should repair this one as well. There we go. And that way I can switch between the two here. This one for getting us more of those things. There we go. The yucca. And let's go and get more wood. Oh. Okay, that's okay. How that missed, I actually don't know. Was the white was the white cross right over his head? Um, I suppose it just was meant to be. <laughs> there we go luckily we are still alive okay we have eight bullets left let's make them count more than what we just did okay we need wood we, we have to ignore all the zombies and just focus on getting wood otherwise it's gonna take forever There we go, just quickly eat one of those. Okay, 
There we go. Nice. Let's have another yucca. Okay, good. Let's go over there, away from all of them. This is going to take forever to collect all that wood if we get constantly interrupted. So we're getting closer to the village now as I'm, uh, or to the, to the town now, as I'm trying to avoid all the zombies that are spawning in the fields and still collect some wood. How much wood do we have now? Let's finish this tree here and have a quick check. And what we need is food. We need food really badly. So maybe this building here is food, which would be really good. Now we have 473. So... Let me see. I also made a garden hole because we are going to have to start thinking about um, planting some of those crops already very early. Like what we, we preferably want is after the first horde night, we want to already have something that brings us in some crops and um, we have water now sorted out. So that's good. And that way we have a little bit of food coming in. Did we already loot this place? I'm not sure. Well, let's have a look. So we're gonna have to keep looting. Now spikes, let me see how many we can craft. 47. We need 62. And how long did that take to craft? Ah, only a minute and 58, so we can wait until we have enough. There we go, we take them apart as well. That is a very good uh, source for wood. And oh, there's a shamway actually. So let's go and get the shamway. Oh, nice, look at that. Ooh. I like it. Ha oh, ha ha, nice. Okay, that's fair enough. Now I know we don't have a lot of room, but in the end of the day, it's food. So we can't throw out things like that or whatever, you know, unless we just want to make gunpowder on our person. So we can do that. That way, um, let's see what other recipes we have for the coal, nothing. Okay, so let's do that. Let's just take the coal with us, and that's it. Murky water, ugh, if we find um, an antibiotic, we can just drink some of the murky water, no problem. Oh, nice. Yeah, we don't need that for now. This is, this is really nice, and we don't need that. Very good. Okay. So I say there's nothing wrong. Oh, look, and there's medicine cabinets and everything. I have a feeling we're going to have a problem with space. Ah, seriously, dude, you're already coming in. What's wrong with you? Okay, there's no zombie here. Oh, nice fridge. Okay, we can eat that. Okay, honey, very nice. I'm already have to try to decide what to get rid of. Probably paper next. Oh, nice, the chest. Oh, I love it. Duct tape. Nice, nice, nice. Things like duct tape are always really, really cool find. Especially in the beginning of the game. Oh. That's outside, I think. Oh, look at that. Oh, nice. Okay, so we're gonna get rid of that. Um, we're gonna get rid of that. Gonna get rid of the murky water. We're trying to keep the ears of corn so we have some food for later. Oh, uh, no. Okay. And glass. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of glass. We don't need glass. Don't care about the empty jars. I take the water, though. Thank you. And more water. There we go. Nice. Okay, so can we drink that as well? Let's eat. Or eat it instead of drinking it. Very good. What is this? Oh, they're just pipes. Okay, cooking pot we have. We don't have to worry about that. I like the way there's glass in front of them. That is really awesome. <laughs> Okay, we are at 100% food now. Ah, I'm not so sure with, about that. We need meat when we have the eggs, so I'm not so really so sure about um, 
What is that? Is there anything in there? Is there a zombie leaning against the door? Well, this is only 300, so why don't we have a look? Okay. Oh, I have no arrows. Balls. I have some steel arrows. Let's quickly switch. There's a gun there. Nice. Okay, that was good. That was good. That was good. I like it. That was a good runaround we gave him. Is there anything? Oh, there's... Don't tell me it goes downstairs there, is it? Does it? Oh, man, I want to see. Oh, don't be like that. Come on. Is there like a secret downstairs? Oh, you're kidding me. I did not know that. That is so amazing. There is a secret downstairs. Okay, we have no room anywhere for looting. Okay, screw the egg. Screw the egg. <laughs> now, the barbed wire is... Um, we might want to put the barbed wire here. And we're going to scrap the can as well to make some room. Okay, so we're micromanaging our room now. There we go. There we go. Just right at the back of the head. Shh. <sighs> oh, seriously? Are you for real? Okay, that's okay. Yes! Okay, so we can close this one. Oh man, this is nice, this is nice. This is exciting! Totally sidetracking, but um, hey, we get wood from this, yeah? Okay, we can use the big one. Get us some nice leather. We can make some le leather armor if we need to. Does it make a difference if we use that one or this one? No. It still gives us three, so it's actually fine. Nah, I'm gonna keep this one. nothing in here because we're still so fragile at this stage of the game it's unbelievable okay we eat and then we scrap i know we can make things out of them but i i i need to conserve space we have spuds but if we can it would be good to take them with us Okay. Now that's it. Let's go to the other side. Okay, this one is a bit trickier because we have to actually burst it open. So it might wake up. Yeah, it might wake up whatever is there. He's, he's putting his head through the hole. So he's gonna get smacked. Love it. Oh, the perfect timing. We did not get hit once. Okay, no zombie here. 
excellent. This is cool. So Apocalypse starts, the shop owner goes like, screw that, goes into his secret little area here where is like loads of stuff, which is absolutely awesome. That is so cool. Okay, let's open this up. Oh, what a pity. Okay, let's scrap that. Pot we don't need. Small stone, fair enough. Okay, if we turn that into another seed, excellent. Now, what is here? Is there something behind it? Let's have a quick look. No. Okay. But it is free iron, like, you know, in the end of the day. I know we could take the TV apart, but I don't want to, I don't, I can't carry the parts at the moment. So this is gonna give us three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, something like that. Oh, nice. There, oh, that is some good iron. That is some good iron. If we could make them fall off the off the ceiling, that would be awesome because that would shatter into much better pieces. These guys here don't give us as much iron. No. But still, better than nothing. Okay, I don't think I left everything here. Oh yeah, do we get wood from here as well? Excellent. That wasn't too bad. Oh, blueberry seeds. We take them. Nails. We can make nails, so we scrap them for iron. Um, I think if we have the energy, we're just going to take all the iron we can. Because how much is this here? How much are the spikes? Let me see. This, these spikes are they're 40 each. Oh, my balls. So, yeah, we can't make enough ever. <laughs> so... We need 62, so say 70, like, yeah, we would need 200, no, 2,800 um, metal iron, 2,800 iron to make all, all the required uh, steel spikes. Well, that's heavily rounded up, but it's approximately that. Yeah, I think we're going to leave this here. We're just going to finish this one and then, yeah. There we go. We have a thousand. And then we're gonna go back home. We're gonna worry about more wood. Anyway, this was pretty cool. I like that. So, do we have enough? Oh, what is here? Mm, don't care. Brass, always welcome. Thank you. Cooking pot, always scrappable. Very nice. Thank you. It's 18, 18 um, steel, not to be uh, iron, not to be scoffed at. There we go. Now let's see what's in here. We haven't finished actually that shop. Oh, nice. So if we could find more of those type of foods, that would be brilliant. <laughs> the ones that stack up so nicely. Oh, get some beer. That would be good. I keep throwing out the empty jars because I don't want them. I can make... Oh, beer. That is exactly what I was looking for. Nice. See, now I can just roll with R because... Yep. Oh, sorry. No more beer. Oh, meat. Oh, that is so handy. But we throw out the egg as well. Oh, okay. Do you know what? Screw... Oh, the paper is very good, though. It's very important. Um, For later on. We're gonna find more blueberry. We have potatoes at home. We have potatoes at home, so let's let's do that. So if we find an animal, we can at least cut that up, and we're gonna get something out of it. Oh man, having a small backpack really makes you think, and it's, it works well, um, you know, in a mod where there's not like an overwhelming amount of items, you know, where you kind of think like, oh crap, I don't know what I need this for yet, but maybe I need it later, and you end up like with not enough space in the bags. Okay, that's it. I think. Oh, no, there's a little bit more here. And, oh, the medicine cabinets as well. <laughs> yep, 
Yeah, we want to take the, the tokens, actually, if we can. That would be really handy. Um, I can make another spear, so that's fine. I'm not really using it in the moment, so let's scrap that for the paper. Oh, man, a first aid kit, that is so important. Oh, man. I want to keep all of that. That's the problem. Um, and stone and everything. Okay, goldenrod. End of story. We, we can get more goldenrod. I mean, we just have to pick it outside. Nice. Um, plant fiber, usually I get rid of as well, but... Um, uh, yeah, actually you're right. Yeah, we don't really need it. Yeah, we can get rid of it. So let's take the blood bag. Uh, let's use that. We don't really need it right now, but hey-ho. Is that hidden behind... Oh, man. We have to loot them from the top. Nice. I wonder if there was anything behind that, because there was no door to it, but there has to be something more behind it. So if I destroy this here, is there something behind it? Oh no, it was literally just that. Oh, interesting. I thought there was a room behind it or something that they were leaning against. Okay, we got all that. We looted all that. Did we miss anything here? Yeah, lockers. Nice, there's some more to scrap. All right, I'm gonna leave this here. This was actually pretty cool. Like, so we found, um, yeah, the beginning is still very slow, guys. Yeah, so sorry about that. But we found, um, I need these frames. Um, some good resources. We found uh, wood. Well, we gathered some wood and we found a really, really cool place. This is amazing. A Bavarian beer shop. That is absolutely fantastic. Anyway, I'm going to leave the episode here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode where we're going to continue working on our defenses, of course. And we're going to actually put the spikes out that we're planning to do in this episode. But it just takes so long to gather wood at the moment. Anyway, and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, feel Spaß and happy gaming. I hope that screamer is gone by now. Oh, I'm hunted. Oh, she's gone. Cool. Is she in here? No. Okay. Okay. She walked away. Oh. Oh, I bet you that's the screamer. I bet you that's the screamer. I don't think she had a chance to scream. Like it. Thank you very much.